So firstly, we will open the uh, Snyder Zulio software. So this is the main interface. So here, what you have to do, click the new programming page and then select your model. Select your uh, PLC model. So here you can see uh, six discrete discrete input and four relay outputs and language only ladder logic there is no functional block so here in this model you can see functional block and ladder logic and this is the uh, model part number so based on the model part number and based on the application requirement of inputs and outputs and voltage power supply voltage source you have to select the models so it's completely based on the your application so before selecting the plc you have to calculate all how many inputs you going to be is going to be used and how many outputs you going to be used and uh, what is my input uh, inputs voltage and what programming language i am going to be use these all things you have to ensure before selecting the model so today for uh, star and delta ladder logic we going to be do it so first model i'll select the sr2a101 pt so click next so and this is the ladder logic interface So firstly what, what we will do, we will assign the inputs. So star and delta, see once we give the inputs, the motor has to be start immediately, main conductor first has to start immediately and the timer, on delay timer we will use no, that also parallelly need to start as well as star conductor need to start parallelly. So after the uh, uh, that preset time in the we we preset time is yet no in the timer so usually 7 second 10 second like that depends upon the motor capacity so once preset time is reached so it has to change into star to delta so firstly uh, we will assign the inputs digital inputs star push button this is the input digital input and stop push button and so input assigned after that output output q1 so first will be a star conductor second delta conductor third output main conduct so output assigned after that timer so first time it's in here on delay on delay seven second so everything we i hope everything we have assigned so now so here what you have to do you just click and track like that place in the ladder section ladder so now it's no if you want to change you have to right click and you can like the normally closed dnc and if you want the no you can right click and you can click no so first this is the start push button this is the images box if you click that command will be open so we will as in the timer first so once i get a start command timer has to run parallelly conductor that the respective conductor has to be on so now timer is enabled command click the images box until a seven seconds is set okay start okay timer okay now we have to insert stop see stop usually become nc okay. now main conductor it's the main conductor and this is the active one coils so you just click and track where you want to place
Okay. Now we will use the NO. So here uh, in the output, there is that star. Star contact. Use this is a star contactor. Just assume. Here also we'll mention on delay timer seven second and uh, star conductor when star conductor has to be enabled so using up timer and see so this is the timer no timer contacts you can get it from here so this is the contact t1 this is coil this is reset and this is the timer contact see you can get a no okay lose nc because uh, Parallelly as to so now when timer going to be start, parallelly star conductor star conductor also has to be enabled. And then and then here we will use star conductor in O. When star conductor is enabled. So here main conductor parallelly has to be start main conductor main conductor is that main conductor main conductor okay so next So next we have to work a star conductor is enabled and the main conductor will be activated. So after that we need to latch so main conductor. No. We need to latch. Once the star conductor is activated, main conductor will be enabled. After changing interchanging the star conductor to delta, main conductor will be keep on activate through this latching circuit. Okay. So next will be a delta. Delta is balanced no? So delta will so star will be NC means so timer is NC for the star. So here NO will come. You can copy and paste as well, and you can change to normally open. And where is the delta conductor? So this is our code delta so delta conductor and now balance is interlock so when star is enabled delta should not be activated when delta is activated star should not be able so here we will use that is a delta this is the contact no address is the contact so click and track over the and change into normally close and about star just click and track into here change into normally close so this is the interlock okay now param uh, timer uh, parameter we need to assign uh, actually timer seconds uh, on delay no that on delay seconds we need to assign if you just double double click in the timer address so here you have to activate the latching and keep seven seconds see this is simple as per the iec standard this star to delta changing the timing no as per the iec standard a small capacity of motor we need to keep five seconds and medium size of motor uh, five to ten seconds and um, more than the uh, more than the like uh, 20 kilowatt and 30 kilowatt above it's a big capacity you can keep uh, 15 seconds like that so now here we will keep 10 seconds okay and we'll keep okay so start so when you're going to be enable the start command through this timer will be activated Timer and parallelly what and all we need to activate a star at the main conductor. So after the preset time, just to change into delta. 
so star conductor immediately has to be stopped so this is the logic of star and delta so now we will check in the simulation so now we will so we have made our ladder logic as per the star and delta operation so he this is the edit mode now it is in edit mode so we will click on uh, simulation mode now it is in a simulation mode and the plc not yet started to run so we will keep activate to run so see you can see here plc is running so we will enable the we will give the start command motor has to be start star and delta motor has to be start so we have started now see you can see uh, main conductor is activated star conductor and timer also activated so after the preset see you can see after the 10 second delta conductor it switched over the star to delta okay it's running keep on running and while changing also or before also main conductor constantly activated so main conductor should not be off while changing the star to delta that you have to ensure while making the logic so this is the ladder logic diagram of uh, star and delta operation so now we will keep off uh, stop push button so this became a normal of all logics i am going to be again start timer star conductor main conductor activated after the 10th second of time star to delta yes Start to delta it has changed okay so now plc in run mode we'll keep it pause and if you want if you are facing any problem in that logic while simulation while running the plc if you are facing any problem in the logic just pause the simulation mode and go click on the edit mode edit mode and you can change and you can simulate again so thanks for watching and is there any other operation any other logic any other application you want uh, for the later logic so you just kindly let me know in the command we'll do it thank you